What's up everybody, Tony Pizza Guy here, back with Universe Mode, and we are going to be doing some great matches. The first one I'm going to be playing is X-Pac, a special guest referee against Chris Jericho, and Ken Shamrock are going to be facing up number one contender for the television title. We have these matches, and our main event is a triple threat match, Hunter Hearst Helmsley versus Cody Rhodes versus John Cena. First person to hit a finisher will win that matchup. So, we're going to do this special guest referee match for... To start off the evening, like I said, I will be playing as Xbox. Xbox. Okay, Xbox. And I made the custom threads, so when you get into it, you'll see it. I made a ref attire that's white and black, so we will do that and we'll get into this. Xbox. Xbox, the special guest referee. And it's going to determine the number one contender because you remember last week when he interrupted the match. Jericho and X, you know, you know what happened. What? Why is he using the superstar threads? Why? What the heck? Okay, so there's been all this television title turmoil, and there's been interferences, and X-Pac has been doing stuff, and Jericho's been doing stuff, and now we're going to see what's going to happen with this contest, where we have X-Pac as the referee for the number one contender match of Shamrock versus Jericho. But I'm very upset they didn't save the threads. When I um, I made the match, I edited it, and then I saved it, and it didn't save it. So we're going to play as X-Pac. All right, so right now we're going to call this one right down the middle. That's what we have to do. We have to determine who is going to be the number one contender. And I don't want to interfere right now. I want to make sure that we call it right down the middle because that's the way we do it. Any man can be number one contender. It really doesn't matter. We know that any one of these men could be number one contender for the world title, but they didn't win the title tournament bracket. So it comes down to Cody Rhodes and Triple H, which will take place at one night only. Cody Rhodes versus Triple H. And the winner of that will go up against John Cena. Tonight we have a triple threat match. Cody Rhodes, Triple H, and John Cena. First person to hit a finisher will win the match. And that will give them sort of a, uh, not really an advantage, but it'll give them a, you know, bragging rights going into one night only. Now, we don't even know who's going to win. We just have to have Cody Rhodes versus Hunter Hearst Helmsley at the Bayview. Then we have to have versus John Cena in the very same night. The thing that's going to be crazy about this is that they will have to have one fight. Basically, how it's going to go down, it will be Jericho. I mean Jericho. It will be Hunter Hearst Helmsley against Cody Rhodes in our semi-main event. And then right after that, John Cena will make his way down to the ring. And it will be John Cena versus the winner of Hunter Hearst Helmsley and Cody Rhodes. So it's like one of those things that don't even get a break in the match. But so far, I'm going to call this one right down the middle, as I said. Right down the middle. And here we go. Let's get in here. Screw job. I don't want to screw him out of it. All right, let's call this one right down the middle. But he's not going to tap because it's too early in the game. And there is that. And again, X-Pac is going to be whoever, you know. I don't know if I'll play as X-Pac at the pay-per-view. I like to play as X-Pac. Let me know if you want to see me play as X-Pac when we get to the pay-per-view against whoever wins this match uh, for the television title. But uh, for the pay-per-view, definitely, definitely, definitely for the pay-per-view, I will... Let every match play out. Um, but so far we'll have this one. And we have the two main events. The number one contender match. And then the match following right afterwards. And the big thing. I mean you really can't do it in this game. But the big concept I want to do is your stamina. How much you can beat up in one night. Um, I wish you could really go and edit their 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 life bar. Yeah, I know you can do it in story mode, but you can't do it in here. Uh, but we'll, we'll just let it play out and see what happens. So, first we have to see how this plays out and see who's the number one contender for the television championship. We know that we have the pre-show for the internet title, Dolph Ziggler. And you guys have been asking me, let Dolph Ziggler, let a Dolph Ziggler match play out and let's see what happens. So, we'll have to see what uh, what's going to happen. I might pull let, let it play out as Dolph Ziggler, but uh, we'll see. Has a whole of arts at his Into the ropes. And, I'm sure we'll be able to and a chop by Jericho. Jericho! 
Breaks down the walls. Come on, get in. Hurry up, get in there. All right, I really haven't done anything thus far. I'm going to let this one go. Um, I have kind of an idea what I want to do, but I don't know what's going to happen. We'll see. Depends on how this match plays out. That's how I'm going to do it. All right, x -Buck. Got this. And you guys have requested that I do special guest reviews for every match that I watch. Play as the ref, but I don't really want to do that. I would, but I don't know. It'd be interesting, but I kind of like just to watch it and see how it actually plays out without me interfering at all whatsoever. I could make a ref call, like a Nick Patrick type ref or something. I don't know, but I don't know. I'm not too sure. Maybe I could find Earl Hebner on there. Maybe Hebner's online. If I find Hebner, then I would definitely do a Hebner ref. And, you know, we could actually recreate the screw job, even though it's already in the attitude error mode. But we could recreate it with Hebner as the ref, the big gimmick of Hebner. Hebner is funny. German by Ken Shamrock. One night only is coming up. Tag team champions of the world are going to be defended. This match is this title match. The television title, depending on who wins this. And then we'll see how this plays out. Hurry up and do something. Jericho takes him down. Oh, big kick. Big kick by Ken Shamrock. Neckbreaker. Oh, Jericho's got the signature. Jericho's going to hit it. It's going to be over. One. Two. Three power bombs. Now hit him with the lion tamer. Oh, I don't want it to be over now. Oh, he kicked out. Okay. All right, we're still good. Still got the lion tamer. Oh, he's got him for the lion tamer. Let's get in there. Let's see how this is going to go. Is he going to tap? Is he going to tap the lion tamer? Let's check it. Check it. Is he going to tap? Are you giving up, Ken? Shamrock can tap? No, he doesn't tap. He didn't tap out. Ooh, Shamrock, I thought it was done, but he's not. Calling it right down the middle. That's what you guys want to see. You want to see me call it down the middle? Because we will call it down the middle. Jericho with a pin. One, two. Oh, I don't want to. No, I didn't. No, 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 no. I didn't want to do a fast count. I don't want it to be over now. Kick out, Shamrock. Okay. Get up. I'm not taking sides here, but I just don't want to see the match end on a Northern Lights suplex like that. Get, come on. Get out. Get out. You got to do something more to impress me. I am the television champion, you know. x Pac. All right, you can call it a screwdriving call, whatever you want, but it's not screwed. There's no screw because I just don't want it to end like, like, how disappointed would you be if I, if I just ended it like that? I would be disappointed. Do something cool. That's what I just said. Oh no, Jericho, what's he gonna do? Woo! Big chop by Jericho. Oh, Shamrock's coming off. Oh, big missile dropkick by Shamrock. Shamrock with a hurricane runner. Hurricane runner by Shamrock. Here we go. Kicks out. How the heck does he kick out already? Alright, whatever you say. I get it, I get it. You know, this game, the, the physics of this game are good, but sometimes I just don't understand the pinning, the pinning physics of the game. It's like, really? That's how you're going to end it? I mean, I get it, but I guess. Alright, get up. Oh, taking him down. Jericho's got another signature. Oh, get out of here, Jericho. I don't want to face you. you. Tried to screw me out of my title last week. Not happening. One. Oh, only a one count. Yeah, you tried to screw me out, Jericho? That's what I thought. All right, Shamrock, get in there and finish him off. All right, that's it. Now get in there and finish him off, Shamrock. I'm giving you all the chance in the world. You stay out of my business. This is my title. Come on, make him tap. Come on, Jericho, tap. Tap, Jericho. Come on, tap. 
Tap, Jericho. Ah, he didn't tap. Oh, he thought it was over. Oh, no. Shamrock, you got to do this on your own. Come on, you'll face me at the pay-per-view. You'll lay down for me, and that'll be it. Trust. All right, you, you just, just do something. You know what? Shamrock's going to be the number one contender, not you. That's all I have to say. Come on, Shamrock. You can do this one. Come on, Jericho's been a thorn in my side for too long, and now I gotta get Shamrock. You know, get Jericho out of the title picture. We'll be fine. All right, come on, Shamrock, you can do this. Here we go. One, two. Oh, he reverses it. One, two. Come on, Shamrock, I give you a chance. Come on, I gotta make it look. I have to make it look legit. Ah. Whatever, I'll save your butt again. All right, Shamrock, you you may be a fighter, but you're not too bright. It comes to things like this, you gotta win. All right, Shamrock, do this. Hurry up and do this, Shamrock. There we go, Shamrock. You got this one. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna. I don't like poking in the eyes. Come here. Don't poke him in the eye, or I will disqualify you. How unfair is that, though, to make the, the, the champion, the special guest referee, the number one contender match? Not something that's good. Whatever. We'll see. Neckbreaker taking Jericho down. All right, Shamrock, you got this. You got this, Shamrock. You can do it. Hurricane Rana by Shamrock. No, you don't want to go for a pin. Come on, kid. You know, hit your finisher and maybe we'll call it a match. You know you need to do it. Once you hit your finisher, I'll call it a match. But until then, a no match. Come on, get out of it. I'm not even going to do anything. I'm just going to sit here and wait till I get a finisher. Hey, <sighs> there we go. All right. Now you can do it. Ankle lock. Ah, what is this? Oh, he's going to choke him out. Sleeper hold, sleeper hold, sleeper hold. Yes. <laughs> screw him. Yeah, screw him. Jericho's never going to win. You're never going to be number one contender, Jericho, ever. And Jericho's pissed. Never, ever. There we go. That's right. X Pac versus Ken Shamrock at the pay per view. Woo! Jericho's been a thorn in my side for too long, like I said. And he's out of here. He's out of the title picture. No more will we see him in the title picture. Shamrock, your number one contender for the television title at one night only. Ken Shamrock. The big bad Rocky Docky. It's gonna be a cakewalk. He's gonna come in. He's gonna. Uh, well, you know what? He might want to win the title, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. We will definitely see what happens. All right, now it is time for this contest. The British Bulldog versus a Road Dog. We have Dog versus Dog. Road Dog wins. Number one contender for the Divas title. Lita is number one contender. Kane Mankind. And now we have our main event Hunter Hearst Helmsley, Cody Rhodes, and John Cena in a finishers only match. Like I said, we have to go in and change it. So let's go in and do that right now. Uh, finisher only. Turn pinfall off. Where's that? There we go. First person to finisher will be the winner in this contest. Again, Hunter is Helmsley, Cody Rhodes, and John Cena is going to prove, well, not really prove, but it'll give us some bragging rights going into one night only. The one who wins this match will be able to say, you know what? I'm going to be champion come one night only. After the pay-per-view said and done, it will be like that. Now, John Cena is the champion currently. But Hunter Assembly is going to take on Cody Rhodes. 
at one end only. And the winner, again, the winner will be the one who hits the finisher in this matchup tonight. But at one end only, the winner will be Cody Rhodes, Hunter Stonesley. The winner of that will go on against John Cena. And the winner will be the WWE Champion. Cody Rhodes is coming out next. Oh, shucky ducky, quack quack, moo moo. Here comes the WWE Champion. Yeah, say. All right, John Cena comes down to the ring. We have this triple threat non title match. First person to hit a finisher will win this contest. We said that before, and we'll say it again. First one to win this contest by hitting a finisher. We have Triple H, Hunter Hurst Helmsley, still Hunter Hurst Helmsley, going up against Cody Rhodes and John Cena. Triple Z on Raw is War. Yes, one night only is just right around the corner. We have one more show, then we have an internet show, then we have the pay-per-view and that will be a good one. A good one night only. Well, think about the matches we have at one and only. We have Shamrock versus X-Pac for the television title. We have New Age Outlaws versus Epico and Primo. Yes, yes, yes. We have Lita versus, I think, Beth Phoenix. I think she's the, the, the number one contender. Dolph Ziggler has an unnamed opponent, which we'll find out. He will be defending his title at the pre-show. Until then, we will have to wait and see. But this is our match so far in a back body drop. Then we'll figure out what else we're going to do come next pay-per-view. But we'll figure it out. Something with Brock Lesnar and Randy Orton, I think. Because they've been having like a little mini rivalry on Raw. Maybe, I don't know. There's some other matches that you'd like to see on the pay-per-view one night only. Because I'm down for anything. Just let me know what you think. And we'll definitely get into that. Definitely get into that. But uh, there you go. Triple H kick to the gut. John Cena punch. Triple H working on the arm. Triple H throwing. Strong edge with Cody Rhodes in there. Oh, and John Cena comes back. Cena, Cody Rhodes, and Hunter Hearst Helmsley. Anything, and I mean anything, can happen in the World Wrestling Federation. Oops, World Wrestling Entertainment. Raw is war, whatever you want to call it. Oh, Cena with the reversal. And as I mentioned before, this will not be decided by pinfall or submission. This will not be decided... By knockout, this will only be decided by finisher. Only first person to hit their finisher is the winner. Punch, 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 punch to the face of Cody Rhodes. And you know, like I said, first person to uh, hit their finisher will get the victory. Triple H looks like he's showing a lot, but Cody Rhodes poked to the eye. It's anybody's game right now. Here we go, Triple H, Hunter Hurst Helmsley with a big body slam, taking him down. John Cena looks like he's taking it easy. He knows that the baby is coming up. He knows he's got to hold on to that title. If he can hold on to the title, that'll be good for him. And wham, takes him down. Low, blow, Cody Rhodes. John Cena, Cody Rhodes going at it. And he's going to drop him on his head. Dropping Cena on his head, trying to soften him up for that crossroads. If he hits the crossroads, it's going to be over because it's finisher only. Or the beautiful disaster. Whatever he does, it may be over. Oh, Cena misses with the elbow. And Triple H with a knee to the face. He's got him for the camel clutch, but the camel clutch will not win you the match. It will only soften up your opponent. So maybe he can hit the pedigree. If he can hit the pedigree. Or soften him up for the attitude adjustment. You know, just Cena's biding his time. He's just standing over watching, letting these two destroy themselves. Which I would if I was John Cena. Let them destroy themselves right before one and only. Then when it comes to the match. It's all over. He's down after the atomic drop. And got him. 
Oh, breaking the arm. Got him by the head. Goes behind. Working on the arm. Cody Rhodes reversal. And pushes him away. He pushes him to John Cena, but John Cena does nothing. John Cena misses with the clothesline. And punched by Triple H. Hunter Hearst Helmsley. Excuse me, I keep calling Triple H, but the same person. You get it. Oh, working on the arm. Reversal by Cody Rhodes. Cody Rhodes is working on the arm. Double team move. A little double team move on to John Cena. Double Russian leg sweep. Taking him down. And a big spine buster. Big spine buster by Triple H. And Triple H is telling him to get up. Hunter, he's telling him to get up. But Cena pulls him up. He misses. Oh, and Hunter. Hunter's going for a back body drop. Drops him down. Hunter's setting him up. Oh, but he doesn't get up. But the wake-up tot does no good. Punches. Oh, and he's got it. What's this? Oh, crossroads. It, it's over. He's... What? He stole his finisher. And Hunter Hurst Helmsley looking good after hitting the cross. What? You could... I didn't even know that was possible. In a finisher only match, you can hit your... You can steal your opponent's finisher and win the match. What a statement he made right there. Not only did he win by finisher, but he won by stolen Cody Rhodes' finisher. Let's take a look at it right here is where he stole his finisher. Wham! And Hunter Hurst Helmsley looking strong. I'm calling it right now. That man is the new champion at one night only. I'm calling it. He's got to go through Cody Rhodes first, and then he's got to go through John Cena in two separate matches. But if he can do that, if he can look strong like he did tonight, we have a brand new champion at one night only. We will have to wait and see what happens at one night only. But that is it for now. God, what a way to end it. Instead of hitting a pedigree, he hits the crossroads. What a dirty, dirty move by Hunter Helmsley by stealing his finisher. But he proved something tonight. He is the winner, and he is looking strong going in to the pay-per-view. One night only. We'll have to wait and see exactly what happens at one night only. But that is it for this episode. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button. And Tony Pizza Guy, frag out. I urge you guys to check out these two videos. First, we have Battlestar Galactica Blood and Chrome Episode 1. It is great. Go check it out on Machinima Prime. And we have my Universe Mode in WWE 13. Check them out.